Hey y'all, this is Leslie. I just want to share a, a quick something with you. Um, on Friday, uh, I was uh, out and about with my sister doing some different things um, in the evening and we were stopping to pick up a pizza um, before we went home. And um, I was turning into, I was coming from the, what is this, from the left? Yeah, and I was turning into the parking spot um, in front of the pizza place and I was too close to the car that was parked on the right. And so of course I hit the car and I wasn't going fast or anything, but I, I hit the car and I was like, man, like, how, like, what was you thinking about? How did you not see? And so I hit the car and my sister's like, girl. I, so I get out of the car and I'm like, man, I now I don't know whose car this is because there's nobody in the car right we're in the parking lot i'm like i would hit a parked car jesus help me so i go in to get the pizza and there's like it's a whole shopping plaza so i don't know for sure where the person is um and i didn't want to go up in the pizza place talking about some hey uh you got this red uh the, 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 uh well i <laughs> i tow it up like you know it was like a lot of people in there like big parties families and I was like, I'm not about to go up in here and get my head beat. Um, so I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna write a note. So as I'm waiting for the lady to bring the pizza, um, I write a note and I'm like, hey, I'm Leslie, I'm sorry, I, I hit your car and blah, blah, blah. Please call me back at this number or whatever. And so I put the, um, put the note on the car and it really wasn't a lot of damage but it does look like it did look like it needed to kind of be buffed out right because i have a, a black car and their car was red and so um i get back in the car and um when i well before i got in back in the car i was like man and there was nobody around right but i'm integral okay and um i say all this to say um i would hate for someone to have hit my car and not left a note or said anything um and now i have no way to contact them and i'm just kind of like you know i don't want to say like up a creek or anything but because i have car insurance and everything and but still you know what i'm saying like i would just hate for somebody to do that to me so number one that's wrong and god don't like unintegral things like that so i'm like let me be honest because that that's just you know um and again, like I say, I would hate if somebody did that to me. And <clears throat> then on top of that, too, I was like, <clears throat> I know there's nobody around, but I know he's always around. I know he always sees. I know he always knows. And as good as God has been to me, for me to let me get back in this car, come on, and, 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 and zoom off or whatever, and, and not say something to someone, <clears throat> you know, when it, I'm in the wrong, I've, I've, I've damaged their vehicle, um, that would just be, that's not cool. And so what I'm trying to get at is, you know, don't do that. Um, if ever you have an opportunity to be integral, um, to be honest about whatever, you know, if you, if you've damaged somebody's property, you know, you were at fault or whatever, um, let them know. Um, our heavenly father is always watching and he expects us to be good Christian disciples, good his children to be good to be honest even when there are not actual physical eyes watching okay and so um i left my phone number and um the gentleman and i actually spoke today and he was like i just want to say thank you for being honest he's like because a lot of people would have just drove off you didn't even have to really leave a note you could have left he's like so thank you so much for being honest and i was like oh you're welcome thank you so much for not you know being upset and angry it was just a very um very casual, very kind, uh, you know, back and forth or whatever. So um, I got his information and I went ahead and called my insurance, got the taken care of or whatever. And then um, I reached back out to him and let him know, okay, everything's good. They'll probably be reaching out to you just to get, you know, whatever information they need so that they can go ahead and get your car repaired. And he was like, again, I want to thank you so much for being honest. You are a very honest person. And I, you know, I'm about... <laughs> almost shed a thug tear um because i kept thinking like when i did it like honesty honesty really is the best policy and for him to be like thank you for being honest thank you for being honest i would have felt like dirt had i drove off i would have been thinking about that for days now i was waiting for him to call me because i didn't know who he was i didn't have his phone number or whatever so you know he reached out and he called it and, and, and what have you but i would have been feeling like dirt for a while thinking like you didn't sit up here and drove off how you go how you how you 
you this this what we do this this how you do this how you move you on here telling the people oh, de, 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 jesus 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 and then you're gonna drive off <laughs> don't do that y'all be integral be honest um yeah it's just it's just it's just what we do it's just who we are um and so if i have to come out of pocket and pay whatever which i don't think i will have to but you know what i'm saying like that's just the risk we we, we run and I would rather have to go ahead and pay for this man's car to be buffed out or whatever to be fixed than to sit up here um, feeling like doo-doo on the bottom of a shoe because I didn't do the right thing in a situation that was so simple and so easy for me to just be integral. Be integral in everything you do. Um, I don't want anybody to ever be able to come back and be like, she a liar, she a this, she a that. And you know, I truly believe like whatever I end up having, if I have to pay something, whatever the, the, the repercussions or consequences or whatever, you know, is of the situation. I believe God's going to take care of it. I believe God's going to honor the fact that I was being honest about what actually happened. So I just wanted to share that and just tell y'all, just be honest. Um, it is nothing, it is no issue that is so big that our father can't solve, right? Um, and this is just a, a little thing, right? This is just but a little affliction. So I'm going on with my day. He's going on with his day. If we need to contact each other again, moving forward, we we will. Um, but God is good, okay? Because it could have been much worse. Um, and there's very little damage to my vehicle. It just needs to be buffed as well. Like, God is good in in and out. In every situation, God is good. God going to get the glory, right? Even in me. Up on that man's car. Lord have mercy. Okay, so that's all I want to share. I hope that just brought a little bit of laughter into your day. And to remember to be integral and honest because people will appreciate that. Um, and yeah, that's it. God bless. Love y'all.